Hello and welcome to this channel. In this video, we are going to look at how to solve a system of linear equations, also known as uh, simultaneous equations, using elimination method. I hope you have subscribed to my channel. If you haven't, please subscribe to my channel and also hit the like button. Okay, here is a, a system of uh, linear equations that we need to solve for the missing variables x and y. So when you look at these uh, equations, uh, they want you to find the values of x and y such that if you replace them in, in, the, in these equations, they are going to satisfy each of these equations. Okay, the values that you're going to find should satisfy uh, these equations, each of these equations. So, since we are solving this by elimination method, first of all, we need to identify which variable between x and y, which variable are we going to, to eliminate. Okay, so we choose the easiest one. So the easiest one is y. So we're going to eliminate y because it's the easiest one. So we are going to eliminate y. How are we going to eliminate y? We're going to eliminate y by subtracting equation 2 from equation 1. Okay? So if you say 3x minus x, we're going to have 2x. Then y minus positive y, uh, these are going to cancel, they will eliminate each other, it's a zero, so it's equal to 5 minus 1 is 4. So to get the value of x, we divide through by 2. Then x is equal to 2. Okay, at this stage, we have found what the value of x is, so we now replace this value of 2 in any of the two equations above. So let's choose equation 2 because we, ha we don't have coefficients in front of the variables. So let's choose equation 2 because it's easy to work with. So where there's x in equation 2, we're going to replace a 2. So we have 2 plus y is equal to 1. So where there's x, I've just replaced it 2 because we found that the, the value of x is 2. Then sub, subtract 2 from both sides of this equation to get the value of y. So this will be a 0. Then you have y is equal to 1 minus uh, negative 1 minus 2 is negative 1. So the values of x and y are these. So you can conclude and say, therefore, x is equal to 2 and y is equal to negative 1. Okay, so these values, if you are to replace them in each of these equations, the above equations, you are going to see that uh, you are going to, they are going to satisfy the equations, each of the equations. Okay. Okay, let's look at the second example. Let's look at the second example. We have um, x plus 2y is equal to 13. Uh, 5x minus 2y is equal to 5. Okay, so take a break, pause the video, and try to solve this system of linear equations, solving for x and y. Okay, so when you look at this, uh, we also look for the variable that we are going to eliminate. So you can see here you have 
positive 2y and negative 2y. So it's very easy for us to eliminate y first. So how are we going to eliminate y first? We are going to, this time around, we are going to add uh, equation 1 and 2. So we are going to have x minus 5x. We have 6x. Then 2y plus minus 2y. This becomes a 0. Then 13 plus uh, 5. 13 plus 5 is 18. So we have 18 here. Okay? So we divide through by 6 to get the value of, of x. So this divides. Then you have x is equal to 18 divided by 3. It's, uh, I mean, 18 divided by 6 is 3. So the value of x is 3. So now, just as we did in the first equation, we're going to replace uh, where there's x in any of the equations above. Okay? So we know x is 3, so let's, let's pick the first equation. Where there's x, we put 3. So we have 3 plus 2y is equal to 13. Okay? So next... Uh, we subtract 3 from both sides. 3 minus 3, this would be a 0. Then we remain with 2y is equal to 13 minus uh, 3 is 10. Then divide both sides by, by 2 to get the value of y. So y is equal to Five. So we can also conclude and say, therefore, x is equal to uh, 3 and y is equal to 5. Okay. Okay, let's look at um, the third example. Uh, we have... 4x uh, plus y is equal to 25. And x minus 3y is equal to 16. So this one is a bit different from the ones that we are from solving. So this one requires some tricks for you to solve it. So first of all, choose the, var the variable that you want to eliminate. Okay? So in this case, let's also choose, um, let's choose y. Okay, if we say, if we choose y, to, we want to eliminate y, then it means that, um, let, uh, let's focus our eyes on the y. Here we have 3y, negative 3y. Here we have positive y. So let's make this first equation to have a 3. So let's multiply the first equation by 3. And since here we have a coefficient of 1, we are going to multiply this also by 1. We are multiplying this by 1. Okay. Okay. So the first, this equation will now be for uh, 12x because 3 times 4x is 12x uh, plus 3y. Okay. Um, is equal to 3 times 25 is 75. Is 75. Then this, because you are multiplying by 1, this will just be the same. You have x minus 3y is equal to 16 is equal to 16 then um, at this time now at this point that's why we now need to choose we either we are going to add these two equations or subtract so in this case because we want to eliminate uh, y we are going to to add 
the first and second equation. Uh, 12x uh, plus x will be 13x. 3y plus negative 3y, this becomes a 0. Uh, this becomes a 0. Then is equal to 75 plus 16 is 91. Okay. Um, so at this point, we divide both sides by 13 to get the value of x. So x is equal to uh, 91 divided by 3 is 7. Divided by 13 is 7. Okay. So uh, now that we have found the value of uh, x, we are now going to replace this value of x in the equations the original in 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 any of the original equations not the ones that you've multiplied by that not the ones that you've mo uh, modified but the original equations you're going to replace the value of x to uh, in the original in one of the original equations in order for you to solve for y so let's pick uh, the easiest one the is one the easy one is this one so we have x minus 3y i'm just picking the original equation this one uh, so we found that x is 7 so we have 7 minus 3y is equal to 16 okay then subtract 7 from both sides okay this becomes a 0 you will have negative 3y is equal to 16 minus uh, 16 minus 7 is 9, positive 9, positive 9. So at this point, we're going to divide by negative 3 in order for you to get, to, to get uh, the value of y. So negative 3, negative 3, negative 3, negative 3, and dividing. So we are having y is equal to 9 divided by negative 3 is negative 3. So we can now conclude and say, therefore, because the value of x is that, so x is equal to 7 and y is equal to negative 3. Okay, so um, I encourage you to uh, subscribe to my YouTube channel once again if you haven't uh, subscribed yet. And I also encourage you to hit the like button and also uh, uh, share and also comment. Um, next, in the next video, we're going to look at how to uh, solve the system of linear equations or simultaneous equations uh, using substitution method. See you in the next video. Goodbye.